Hey, what's going on, guys? I'm going to talk today about uh, Venezuela's UN ambassador, ambassador of the United Nations, Rafael Ramirez, and he is a liar and a corrupt thug. And recently, out on the streets of New York, there was a woman with him, and apparently, somebody bit the woman or bit at the woman. Um, these were protesters surrounding Rafael Ramirez and the woman he was with. They were chanting. Um, um, protest words and uh, voicing their opposition to Venezuela's, uh, the Maduro government's authoritarian rule. And people should not be focused on if that woman got bit or not, okay? Because there has been way more violence directed towards the Venezuelan people than that situation, okay? You could argue the protesters in New York went too far biting the woman, but that is very mild compared to what's going on in Venezuela and what Rafael Ramirez is lying and covering up. Okay, he has told the United Nations that they don't have, um, they don't have a crisis in Venezuela. That there's not a humanitarian crisis. That there's not a um, political crisis. And the fact is, those are both lies. And, and I'm sorry, I lost my train of thought right there. And Rafael Ramirez constantly, um, he has people that are part of the Venezuelan UN Human Rights Council that work under him. And the UN, the Venezuelan representatives at the UN Human Rights Council constantly veto any pro, uh, proposition that comes through that tries to get uh, answer the human rights crisis in Venezuela. They're blocking any UN resolution that could come through to condemn Venezuela and the Maduro government on the human rights situation. And that is, you know, that that's horrible. And it's... And needs to stop. So Rafael Ramirez deserved to have protesters around him and protesters to chant. I don't don't recommend that these protesters get violent in any way, but the protesters need to make known um, what is going on in Venezuela. And Rafael Ramirez does not need to have peaceful moments when he goes out and about. Now it doesn't mean, but you can surround him and you know sit at the table next to him and voice your opinion about what's going on. You know, the Maduro thugs throw opposition opposition protesters in jail, and the vast majority of these opposition protesters are peaceful, and they're trying them in military tribunals when they are, when those people are being arrested as civilians. Anyways, I hope everyone's doing well. Take care. God bless. Bye-bye.